Yo, what's up everyone, welcome back to the channel and to the vlog. Today we have a super exciting video for you guys. Today we're showing you guys how to 100% complete the entire Turkey Day event in Animal Crossing New Horizons on the only day you can do the Turkey Day event throughout the whole year. First thing you're going to want to do is open your game and you're going to see the Turkey Day event happening in the Town Hall. So, when you go up there, you're going to see two tables with two uh, these dinner plate things each. These are covered, and then you're going to have to cook for everyone. And then you're going to want to talk to Franklin, and Franklin will tell you what to do first. So here you just see me interacting with everything. And then, let's go talk to Franklin. He's going to tell us what our first recipe is. So, I sped this up because it takes a pretty long time, and he's going to introduce himself. So... Um, I sweat it up so we can see what our first recipe is. Our first recipe is a clam chowder. You're going to need three manila clams for this. So just letting you know, um, some recipes are different, so just be careful. So right now this is the Northern Hemisphere guide for this. Manila clams are pretty easy. Once you see the little squirty thing come out, um, that's when you dig it up. And when you get three of these, go back to Franklin, and then we'll cook this clam chowder. I'm so excited. You're gonna give him all these three manila clams, and then he's gonna get this cute little um, cutscene thing. Let's get cooking. And then, ta-da! There is your clam chowder, guys. Look how delicious that is. Everyone's clapping, they love you, and everything. He's gonna tell us what our next recipe is. By the way, every single time you complete a recipe, he is going to give you an item. For this instant, he gave us a turkey day rub. So our next recipe is the pumpkin pie. You're going to need one orange pumpkin and a random other color pumpkin that he's going to tell you. Okay? So this is the first one that's a bit different. When you, once you get your orange pumpkin and your random pumpkin that he tells you to get, select them and give it to him. Let's get cooking. And take a look at that. Oh, yeah, guys. Look how delicious that looks. Everyone's clapping. Everyone's singing. Oh, my God. They love you. Everything is amazing. Now, he gave us a turkey day wall. Our next dish is going to be the gratin. You're going to need a round mushroom and a mussel. For the mussel, you're going to have to jump off your pier and go dive for it. And the round mushroom is the most common mushroom, so you can look out for your island and you'll see... Mushroom. So, our gratin, right here, give it to him, not the oyster, <laughs> that. Okay, once we have it, we're going to give it to Franklin. Let's get cooking. Oh yeah guys, look at that, amazing, wonderful, we all love it, they're all happy, everyone's happy, because you cooked it. He gave us the turkey day flooring, what amazing. Next, we need the fish, uh, I think it's called Menuar, I don't know if I'm saying it correctly, but you're going to need a dab, and you're going to need a sea bass, so those are pretty common, and once you put that, it's going to, uh, yeah, 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 I have them, everything is great. So, one thing is that after you get all these, there's something called the secret ingredients, you need four of these secret ingredients to complete the turkey day event. So right now, I already accidentally did one, but if you see on the pumpkin pie, it has this shine, this golden shine, okay? The golden shine means that you have 100% completed that one, and you need the secret ingredient. So let's go over the manila clams, uh, not the manila clams, the clam chowder secret ingredient. The clam chowder secret ingredient is the scallop. You go diving for the scallop, and you'll get the scallop. The scallop is the secret ingredient for this. Once you say, okay... Um, you give him the scallop. You only need these to be in your inventory. You don't have to select them. So that's an awesome thing about that. So once you give him, him the scallop, let's get cooking. Now you'll see the, um, the clam chowder has this golden shiny thing. Amazing. Next to the pumpkin pie, it also has this shiny thing. Check out that. What a wonderful, wonderful sight. Yay! Everybody's d doing the shiny things over the shiny thing. So that's right. Our next, um, our next secret ingredient is the pumpkin pie. 
So, for the pumpkin pie, you have to give them a color of a pumpkin that you did not do already. So you cannot give him an orange pumpkin, and for my case, you cannot give him a yellow pumpkin. So, right now, I only have the green pumpkin and white pumpkin, so I gave him my green pumpkin. And then, you'll get the thing. So, he's gonna say, let's get cooking! That's my favorite part by far, let's get cooking. There it is, there's the shiny thing. Ta-da! Everyone's happy, everyone's doing the confetti shiny thing, new reaction. He's gonna give us the turkey cake casserole for that. What, what a nice guy, thank you for the casserole. Next thing we're gonna do is... The Dungeness Crab is going to be our secret thing for the Seafood Gratin. Dungeness Crab is um, is pretty common, so you guys won't have trouble finding it. There you guys go. Shiny Seafood Gratin. Now, the final thing we need for the, uh, the, the, the shiny things is the Fish Menuar. I have no idea if I'm saying that correct. This one, the bear knife jaw, I had the most trouble finding. It took me at least an hour and a half to find, and um, it was pretty tough, but I found it, I fished for it, dumped in some fish bait, and let's get cooking. So yeah, I was pretty mad that I couldn't find it, but I did find it eventually. There we go, yay, the final thing. So, as, uh, as, as a thing for getting all these, he gave us a DIY bundle of every, sing of every single turkey day item. And you can actually get these actually in the, in the Nook shop if, um, in the next day, after Thanksgiving. But, it is not the next day yet, but we have them early. So, one thing, you guys are probably wondering, what happens if I don't have them? If you actually go into your villagers' houses during the event, you can see them in their cute little outfits. They are cooking. If you talk to them and they ask for you to give them something, you start, they're going to give you a random item that's going to be useful that you have to use for this event. So you have to take your chances, give them, give them the thing, and then um, yeah, you just got got to hope for the best and be able to get it. So after I fished for the. Um, for the um, bear knife jaw and I couldn't get it, I actually did go up to someone in my villagers and then um, we traded. We traded for the bear knife jaw. You can see that clip right here. <sighs> see the heads. <gasps> no! No! Oh my god, Zucker, no! Oh my god! <laughs> Finally! <laughs> Finally! Oh my god! <laughs> so here are all the new Turkey Day items. You get the Turkey Day chair, you get the Turkey Day table, Turkey Day garden stand, Turkey Day hearth, Turkey Day Casserole, Turkey Day Decorations, Turkey Day Wheat Decker, and Turkey Day um, Table Setting. So now you're going to see me craft all of these. Took a long time and everything. Crafty craft craft. Um, I didn't have any room in my inventory, but we crafted the fireplace. I don't know why they call it the hearth, I just call it the fireplace. Crafty craft craft and everything. And now I'm going to show you guys my full setup for Turkey Day. So, this is every single item, and I'm going to show you guys how to craft them, too. Um, you can actually, um, if you go back, you can actually pause and see when you can get it. So, here it is, guys. Check it out. I hope I can bring friends over uh, today or tomorrow to um, check out the Thanksgiving, but check that out, guys. Look, look how beautiful that is. So, you're able to get multiple of the tables, so I did that, and I put out the casserole. I put out um, everything, I put out the stands in the back, I had the fireplace, it's on, beautiful, it's nice, everything's great, everything's chill, I love it, I love this turkey day event, and you actually customize these, so it's not just all a waste and just for one day of the year, so um, you can actually make these look like spring decorations and the customization things, but yeah, that's pretty much it, check it out guys, check that out. 
So thank you guys all for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to give it a thumbs up if you, uh, if this was helpful to you in any way. Make sure to tell me down in the comments below. So thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. And until next time, see ya.